Hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Avita. If you are new here, thank you so much for stopping by. And if you have returned to hang out with me here on YouTube, I truly appreciate it. So today I am doing my first collab with my beautiful sister friend uh, from Makeup Therapy. Her name is Manuela. And today I am going to be using the Beauty Bay New Mood Palette. So we're gonna jump right in. So here is a look at the palette. I think I'm gonna go with the uh, blue, green, uh, maybe this yellow. So here we go. Uh, I'm not going to name the brushes that I'm using, uh, mostly because I won't be able to read the names anyway <laughs> when I start. So, uh, First of all, I'm going to use this color here, which is Blessed. So, something really wonderful and exciting happened. I actually got to meet Manuela in person in California. She lives in Scotland with her two beautiful little girls. And she flew all the way to America to visit our other sister friend, Yannette who lives in California, and our uh, beautiful sister, Heather, also uh, came to the sisters' gathering, and it was absolutely fantastic. I do have uh, a vlog coming up of the trip. So, Manuela is this gorgeous, tall, voluptuous goddess. <laughs> I know uh, when we were there, we had gone to, um, well, we went to TJ Maxx, Elta, Sephora, and you know, we had to make a makeup, a couple of makeup runs while we were there. And she, she had gotten out of the car last, so we had already walked uh, up to the entrance of the, the whichever one we were at and I was looking at her and she had on this beautiful dress and had a, a slit up the side and I was like she is just stupid sexy oh I swear um, she is very knowledgeable about makeup and color combinations and the girl knows her shimmer. Yes, she does. So she is uh, a really beautiful, smart woman, and uh, she has a wicked sense of humor. <laughs> she's quick-witted, that's for sure. Uh, but she's just delightful and wonderful, and I'm I'm so glad. Uh, I got a chance to meet her. We met in uh, a previous makeup group, uh, but we are in a different makeup group now. And um, just the, the love and um, respect and appreciation and understanding and no judgment and uh, uh, sharing and laughing or it's just a wonderful, wonderful, um, beautiful group of women and I'm so grateful and so appreciative that I got a chance to meet, meet these beautiful women and uh, and I got to meet you know, 
three of them in person, um, <clears throat> which is just amazing. So look out for my vlog video. So I'm going to go in with this beautiful uh, deep blue shade here. Can you see that? Okay. Start with that in my outer V. So I hope everyone has been doing well. Yes, again, I've been away for months. Uh, <laughs> let me tell you. Uh, most of 2023 and into 2024 has been very eventful and very uh, challenging, uh, especially medically for me. But I am doing my best to. Uh, Keep my keep my mental health in check about it. I got a little patch patch right there. I believe. You know what? I didn't put my eyeshadow primer on yet. Yeah, uh, I've been distracted today <laughs> by a medical issue. We're just gonna keep it pushing. Just not holding that spot. Or maybe that's just my little flappy fold there. Probably. Sometimes my uh, lighting throws. And uh, I'm not wearing glasses, so. Now, I, I have used Beauty Black Bay before. I think maybe I've used two of my Beauty Bay palettes. I have several of them. I can't help myself. <laughs> and I'm an eyeshadow palette hound, that's for sure. And I didn't do my eyebrows first today either, which is very not like me. But like I said, we're going to keep it pushing today. I'm not going to name the brushes, uh, I mean tell you what numbers or anything, but I, I am using uh, Sonya G and Smith and I think I have a couple of Wayne Goss brushes I'm going to be using today. <clears throat> Excuse me, I hope I'm speaking loud enough and I hope my fan is not an issue, but y'all yeah, don't want to see me melting on camera, so I got to have my fan on. Okay, now...
shadows are pretty soft and uh, laying down nicely. Not, uh, I'm not really getting a kick up in the pan, and the shadows are not blowing away. You know how that happens sometimes when you are applying. So, yeah, this is nice. And the pigmentation is showing up uh, without my base under the bottom too. So. Okay, I'm gonna go back into the deeper blue, which is confident. And I'm sorry, this shade I just put on is content. And you know, I was supposed to do this uh, collab video. Uh, embarrassingly late I am so my apologies been well up, but I'm finally doing it uh, and you know it's um, even though I'm late very 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 late you know it it's the perfect palette uh, with it being named new mood because uh, I am, I do have a new mood and, and, and part of that new mood is because Manuela uh, inspired all of us to get together because she went to visit our other sister friend who is my sister Moon Eva. And you know, Manuela was talking about how, you know, we've known, we've, we've met, we all met over, basically all of us over a year ago. And, uh, well, Eva just celebrated her, the second birthday that I've known her. So, yeah. So, um, and, you know, we love each other and we care about each other and sisters and online and she motivated us to that the people that you love and you care about you should you should see them you should meet them you should hug them and and be with them and so uh, we're planning more gathering back into that confident shade. Yeah, I lost Yeah, so uh, that's, that's my new, you know, a new mood of uh, traveling to see the people that you, you know, love and care about. Energetic. That shape right here. Oh, 
boy, should I go with that? You know what? I think I'm going to go with the, next, the other shade. It's a shimmer. And it's called Creative. Flat shader brush. And I'm not going to wet my brush yet. I'm going to see how well this shimmer shows up without wetting it. Key today. Okay, I'm going to do the other eye and then I'm going to wet my brush off and come back. She has a matte one, but this isn't the matte one. So, well, let's see how this works. Well, as far as a shimmer goes in person, I'm really not, I can't really see how it's coming off on camera. Oh, my setup is a little different than it used to be. Could zoom it in though. And see, if I, don't go the wrong way. I'm gonna go the wrong way, I know it. I have no idea. <laughs> it's okay.
that's really how I do my shadows. I just, I go back and forth. That first blue I used is slowly turning black. <laughs> What has everybody been up to? How has everybody been doing? I, me and my husband went to the movies and we have not been out to see a movie in years. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, first we went out to this great, oh, uh, Chinese restaurant. A uh, buffet. Everything was, was really good, and I was hoping it would be because we went to a fabulous one when we were in California uh, visiting Annette. And I was like, oh, I hope it's as good. Almost as good, but not quite. Not quite as good. Okay, I'm gonna take uh, this gold uh, shimmer in the palette. I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to use this one, which is kind of a, know, kind of slightly uh, bronzy shade, or this gold shade. Oh, that kind of looks like a, oh, it's a dual crown. I don't know if you can tell. This one right here, we're gonna go with this one right here. And this one is called um, Euphoric. Oh, yeah, so I was talking about the movies. We went to go see um, Kingdom Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes. It wasn't the story I was expecting, and I know I probably saw the original uh, back in the 70s. Or maybe it was in the 80s when they started doing the movies. I don't know. Uh, but it was a good story, and I liked it. I'm looking forward to seeing the, the next one, which is Battle for the Planet of the Apes. My honey told me that's the second one that's coming up. Okay, I can see the dual chrome a little much better on my left eye. Like I said, I think it's probably due to my lighting. I'm gonna wet my brush here in a minute and go over it again though like I do with the other shade. Okay, so I'm gonna 
So it was fun to get out and go to the movies. And um, it's, since it's been so long since we went, they had these nice, wonderful reclining seats. You put your feet up. I was like, honey, we gotta come to the movies more often. This is nice and comfortable. We missed the popcorn and soda though. We saw the nine o'clock show and they probably closed it down probably about then because about 30 minutes into the movie I wanted some popcorn and stuff. Oh, oh I gotta tell you a cute story. Y'all know I always got a story to tell. So when we were in the restaurant, uh, these three kids came over to our booth and there was two little girls one of them, the, the girl that had the glasses, she was probably about seven. Uh, the other girl was probably about nine. Uh, and then there was a little boy, and he was probably about eight years old. And he had an ice cream cone. He never said a word. So the little girls come over and they've got their cameras up. <laughs> and they ask, which is better, Sephora or Ulta? And I said, I guess they came and asked me because I had, you know, makeup on. And I said, well, I think uh, Ulta is better because Ulta has high-end and affordable makeup, you know. Uh, so you have a bigger variety as far as, you know, price goes. If you're more, you know, if you need more affordable makeup, they've got that. And if you like the middle to high-end, they've got that. And uh, one of the little girls said, yeah, I think Ulta's better too because Sephora is nasty. <laughs> and I said, why'd you say that? <laughs> and she says, because it's not clean in there. And people come in there and they steal and they make a mess and they don't clean it up. And I was like, ooh, child. <laughs> Talk about the shade that's being thrown right now. Um, but yeah, it was cute. It was, it was a cute little, a cute little thing that happened. My camera cut off. <laughs> I've been doing lives for uh, a few months on um, TikTok. So, you know, it doesn't, the camera doesn't cut off and, uh, cause I'm actually recording on my phone and this camera has a 30 minute uh, time limit. So I, I didn't do much else. I went back into that uh, blue, the blue, the purplish blue, and then the deeper blue a little bit. And uh, so now I never did wet my brush on uh, the duo chrome. So I'm going to do that. And I'm gonna try to keep an eye on my clock. So we're gonna take that shade, what's the name of it again? Euphoric. Uh, right there. <laughs> uh, so I don't remember what else I was saying after that, uh, but yeah, that was, <laughs> that was really cute though. Really cute. Uh, when we, you guys have seen in the, um, in the vlog but when we were in California we went to the uh, swap meet and they had a um, um with the brush <laughs> they they had a tribute band there and it was um they were doing Taylor Swift and these two little girls just with the kids <laughs> kids again and Manuela was dancing and Heather were dancing and the, the two little girls came over and they started dancing too and then the song went off and Heather sat back down and then the little girl came back and said well, I think she said excuse me ma'am but there's another song so Heather got back up <laughs> and Manuela got back up and they were dancing it was just sweet. It was so fun. And, uh, you know, they're uh, young at heart, you know, just being young at heart, having a good time, dancing with these little girls. 
It was gorgeous. It was a gorgeous day. That's a little better with me wetting my brush. I can see the dual chrome a little better. You guys probably can't see it on camera though. Hopefully you can. Okay. So with that being done, I am going to, uh, well, you might be able to see, because I said at the other end that I was like, I was going to do my brows and then I was going to do my complexion and come back. But then I looked up and noticed I hadn't been recording. So I did do my brows. So I'm going to do my complexion and then we're going to come back and I'll play with these eyes. Okay, sorry if I'm looking up. I'm looking at my viewfinder. Sorry about that. Okay, I'll be right back. <laughs> Okay, I basically finished my complexion. So I'm gonna go back up to my eyes. I lost a little bit of that deeper blue shade called Comfort. Okay, that's good. Now, I'm thinking that I am going to go into this shade here in Rise. Oh, okay, it is a dual prompt with that. That's what that looks like. So we're going to take that and we're going to put that. Uh, this brush. And I'm going to take this brush. It's kind of a pinky. Pinky, kind of bronzy. The, the dual crown is kind of, um, they go together, right? They're similar. Oh, I, I don't mind that. I, I don't mind that. I'm gonna wet my brush. I don't know if you guys can see any difference uh, in that adding that shade, but I am gonna wet my brush and we're gonna go back in to that shade. Yeah. So I would suggest wetting your brush with these because you get more of a payoff. All right, we're gonna go back into the, I'm just gonna call it purple shade. It is, you know, purple though. Is that, what do they call that? Periwinkle blue? Is that it?
Now we are going to move into our, uh, I'm gonna put on my liner. And I'm probably gonna just speed through that in the editing. Just to save time. Alright, I'm gonna um, pop off and put on lashes because I'm not putting you off of that. Because <laughs> sometimes it takes forever, depending on the lashes I choose. So I'll be right back. I'm gonna put on some lashes and then we're gonna do our lower lash line and lipstick and highlighter and then we will be done. Oh, then I gotta change clothes. Alright. See y'all in a minute. Okay, I am back with my lashes. We're gonna start our lower lash line. I'm gonna take uh, Confident, which is the blue shade. And I'm gonna take that same brush and just put a little bit on the tip of the brush. Yeah, so I was talking about this, the name of this palette being the, the perfect thing because uh, I do have a new mood of, I mean, even though here lately I have been struggling with my mental health and I've been struggling with uh, some grief because my younger brother passed away uh, a few weeks ago and uh But what I'm, oh, oh, yeah, so with that happening and, you know, that, that happened after 
the trip to California had been planned and I contemplated not going and then I, I said I would go and I, I believed my brother would want me to go and I, I did and I got I got signs and signals from him that he was happy about that. His one of his favorite songs kept playing while I was away. Um, but the new mood is I have to uh, be spontaneous sometimes. You know, the trip was uh, just kind of just popped up for me, and it was I'm going and. Uh, I want to, you know, have more of that in my life and, and you know, live it to the fullest and uh, don't put things off uh, meeting people that you met online and spending time with them, going somewhere and enjoying yourself and spending some time away from, you know, the troubles that you have. And so, you know, that's part of the, the new mood I have. Um, uh, yeah, it, it really is. Okay, I'm gonna take um, this pencil, little pencil brush. And I'm gonna take that, this uh, kind of neon green. Am I gonna do that? Cause I have a couple of pencils here that I was gonna use. Uh, I was gonna choose one of these. I think I'll just go with the pencil. So I'm gonna take the darker green. And we're gonna put that in our waterline. I'm gonna take this shit. And that one is gracious. Take this brush right here. This is a Sonia Kashuk uh, liner brush, but I only use it for unicorn highlight. It's my favorite unicorn highlight. I'm gonna cover my problem again. Sorry about that. <laughs> And a little mascara on our lower lashes. If your mascara gets dried out, take some just plain eye drops. Like this is just the Walgreens generic brand. And put a few drops in it and bring your mascara back to life. Head to life. Okay, y'all, I got myself all presentable. <laughs> so uh, this is the finished look. I hope you guys uh, enjoyed the video. Uh, thank you so much for watching. And I just wanted to say, um, uh, please take care of yourselves and others out here in the world. And please know that you are worth it. You are worthy. You are loved and you um, are important. Please love yourself more tomorrow than you do today because you deserve it. Again, thank you so much for being here and I hope to see y'all in my next video. Bye.